Um, it's so dark. I'm going to plug in this thing now. Um, yeah. Um, Uncle Howard, do you remember, um, then Grandpa Spencer put in um, a whole bunch of tobacco one time, and then John Lucas Place, and he used to, can you remember back that far? He put in 29 Your acres dad. of tobacco. Who? Your dad. 29 acres of tobacco. Then John Lucas's place down there. Then before he went to Iowa. No, he didn't put in that much. He put in. Was that that before he went to Iowa though? Just before he went, or? Mm -hmm. I'm. I just. These are just things I've heard. I. No, he never did. Yeah. Eight acres is most he ever did have. And. And that was on John Tuttle's place. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Then he went from there. He went to. Um, well, he went to Iowa right after that, didn't he? Um, um, well, see, these are things that I've, I've heard from over the years, and I hadn't talked about them in well, I think you did go a lot of years. He went to Iowa in 25 or 6, something like that. And then uh, he went busted uh, about probably 29, didn't he? Well, and you go broke? No, he, he moved back and... He don't stay out till you. He moved back in '27, I think. Right? Mm -hmm. Something like that. Late I know. And then he, he was married in '25. So he was still in Iowa. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. He was. Um, he wasn't married when he was first came out to it. No, no. Then he moved down there at Spurrier and uh, yeah. had that the house burned. Yeah. And at about 60 or so, he built a he rebuilt a house, didn't he? He was, must have been around 60. Yeah, he was. As I can remember that. I can remember it burning. I can remember. Well, he didn't live too long after that. See, he died. In yeah. When? Thirty. Oh well, yeah, you. When did he die? Well, I don't know. See, I was born in twenty-five. When and, did your uh, dad die? Nineteen thirty-six. Nineteen thirty-six. Yeah, I'd have been eleven years old. Well, uh, um, he went down in twenty-seven. He was there about nine years before. Yeah. I can. I wanted to. I wanted to thank Aunt Leona publicly and and uh, all my aunts and uncles for taking care of me in '48 when I came out here. I can still remember leaving your house to get married. Yeah, I remember and, that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, staying there. How nervous he was, boy! I never will forget. My whole uh, family tied on backward and everything else. That's the reason I only. I got. I don't. I don't want to go through that one time. <laughs> That March, uh, that was uh, February the 6th, 1949. I came out here March the 8th, 1948. Uh, I'll never forget that. And then uh, me and Aunt Lucille used to go down. Where'd we go, Matt? Where'd we go? Let's don't tell. <laughs> Let's don't tell, Al. <laughs> was it Mathersville? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We used to have a lot of fun. And I remember we went fishing. I had that 1937 Ford convertible, you know. We drove out on that levee. Remember that? <laughs> <laughs> That's been a long time ago, really. D didn't we have Audrey then? I don't uh -uh. think we did. She don't remember it, right? You and I were the only ones dumb enough to get in that car and ride down that levee, though. Yeah, we was the only one in it. Oh. <laughs> We, we caught some fish. It. Yeah, I thought you backed it down. You backed it down. Right? Backed it down, no, I think. Backed it down and no. backed it. I can't we remember. Drove, it down we we couldn't turn around. We had I to drive one way and back up the other. <clears throat> I want to turn it off.